Hey, what's up guys? Matt here from Mobility Matters, here to work on some daily mobility, and we're gonna continue this, uh, this plan of attack, working on this lower limb here, the calf, and right around the ankle area. So specifically what we're gonna work on is ankle flexion. How far can we make our ankle go forward? So right now you see where I am. Let's see if we can improve on this right one. So I like the Battle Star, but not everybody has one of these in their gym. So what you can do or use instead, the fancy Battle Star by MobilityWad.com, is use a bar. Doesn't matter what kind, female bar is a little bit skinnier. If you need a little bit more pressure, I'd go with that. So two and a half weights, you can clip them on there. And we're gonna start by going down low here, right in the uh, the soleus where the, the Achilles tendon kind of comes in and just go right above that area. And you're gonna work your way up by rolling the hands back. But what we're gonna do first is we're gonna pull the hands towards you. You're gonna feel that stretch and you're gonna pull your foot in. And you're gonna feel this, some, some of you may even feel this all the way into your hamstring. And that's okay, because remember this whole thing is connected back here posteriorly by what's called fascia. And the fascia ties everything together. So that's why you're gonna get a little bit of stimulus. So like I said, roll it forward to make it go up. But we're only gonna go up to about here, so don't go fast. And roll it towards you to tighten that the skin and the muscle relation back there. Because it's all together, held together by the, the fascia. Just work it back, peel it open. Whew. Two minutes is a minimum here, always. You can take it to three if you want. Do you think you withstand that? You start to get the tingles though. Take the pressure off. There's no need to make it go numb. I'm not doing a whole lot of side to side rotation, just working on the, the flexion of the ankle. Because the flexion at the ankle at the bottom of the squat is crucial, especially if you're an Olympic lifter. You need some more ankle range of motion, you wear shoes, and you still can't get into that overhead or that bottom of that squat. You need to work on this right here. This is for you. Flexion, wind up that tissue by pulling back, opening it up. All right, let's test. So you saw me the first time, second the second time. Woo! Just drop it straight on down to this side over here. I don't know if you can see on the opposite side. But this knee's gonna go a little bit further than the other one. See it kind of sticking through or forward a little bit more? So I'm able to get a little bit more ankle range of motion just by cleaning up the back of these tissues. So maybe if you want to work on this after your workouts or before your workouts to kind of improve some range of motion, whatever you do, whether you do it before or after, make sure you plug, plug in some, some exercise or some movements. That way you can kind of practice that new range of motion and program it into your, your, your motor patterns so that it becomes a habit. Hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. Have a great day. And always remember, mobility matters.